Hey, what's going on out there, YouTube? This is SDL0320 representing JVS. I'm back here again for another review for Fear the Walking Dead. This is the ninth episode of the second season. And uh, this is just my review slash reaction of it. I'm going to post up an actual reaction. Uh, I'll try to cut it down as much as I can so it doesn't get blocked again. <laughs> um, but, I mean, the episode was very entertaining. I, I mean, I thought that... I don't know. I was torn with this episode. That I felt that the story arc for Nick uh, and just him being in this location and being with this doctor, or now we find out in this episode more of a leader, which I'm going to label him the uh, the pharmacist. Uh, he's got his interest in philosophy and perspective of how to do things, and then just what happened like with Nick. I thought that that could have been an episode in and of itself. Uh, and then just kind of tied it off and then move to the other stuff that's going on. Kind of like how The Walking Dead did with The Road to Terminus. But at the same time, they decided they wanted to go and touch on what was going on with Madison, what was going on with Strand, uh, what was going on with the daughter, what was going on with Ophelia. And I mean, I think it was actually really good. Uh, it was a lot of really good banter and conversation. I think I was most primed and, and really intrigued by Madison and Strand's dialogue while they were drinking. The problem that I had with it is what they did afterwards. I was like, how stupid could they be, you know? But I finally got a name drop in uh, Madison's uh, husband or late husband, Stephen. Uh, and then just dialogue and them kind of like flirting back and forth. But I think Strand really truly understanding the depths of Madison's anger and malice. And then even for me as a viewer, understanding that a lot of the things that Nick has about him comes from his dad's darkness and it wasn't so much perpetuated that his dad was just had a medical issue I think he might have had an addiction so that is that actually makes a whole lot of sense now Ophelia and uh, I keep forgetting her name the daughter they're I don't know what they were doing I was like I don't know I was kind of thrown off by that a little bit but oh no it was actually a pretty decent episode um, I'm torn between an 8 and 8.5 out of 10. I'll probably keep it at an 8.5 out of 10. This is definitely one of the better episodes. Um, it wasn't like a lackluster kind of thing. It was a lot of things kind of going on. And I think enough stuff was given to me that I was like, okay, I'm satisfied. But when I looked at the preview for the next episode with Chris and Travis, that is what I'm actually more interested in, just looking to see what things go. But the end of this episode what's going on with Madison and Strand and then just everybody on that side like I don't I don't know what they're gonna do <laughs> so either way I hope y'all enjoyed that reaction slash review I will be putting out like I said my reaction for the full episode keep it locked JVS we ain't gonna stop I will see y'all next week oh and stay tuned on Wednesday nights every Wednesday night we're gonna try to do a live discussion for Fear the Walking Dead with the Monsto, Jarrell's Alexandria, possibly Joe Johnson and I'll talk to y'all later Peace.